Welcome to Auto World of Conway, where today we'll be previewing this beautiful 1962 Buick the Saber. This particular model, a four-door hardtop. You might ask yourself, why this car? But I'll tell you, as we discuss and preview this car today, you'll understand exactly why this car. Finished in bimini blue over blue interior. If you wanted a four-door cruiser, this would be the one to have without breaking the bank. So we'll spend a little bit of time understanding her true condition, what makes her so special, and why it should be the next car in your driveway. This is from Fayetteville, North Carolina, from the original owner, still on the original title from 1962, with 63,000 original miles as documented, and what I believe to be mostly original paint, but I have seen some touch-ups which we'll discuss. Body is straight, no rust that we can find. What a great addition it would be! So, this car has been parked for about 15 years. And we have resurrected her, serviced her, and recommissioned her for you, the next owner. So we'll discuss a little bit about what that meant and what was entailed. I almost expected this to have suicide doors as I've been driving a 67 Lincoln Continental convertible for the last two weeks. This may have been the mother's car. The father would have driven a two-door version, maybe in Victo. So you can see some touch-ups, the paint here, the rocker. various other touch-ups. She has four new white wall tires, brakes all the way around, new fuel tank, fuel pump, some spots on the hood that you need to be aware of. I don't know why they're there, but that is the worst of them. The chrome still presents pretty well as in original condition. This fender has been repainted. You can see some checking here. That typically does not show up on photographs, so that's why we make these videos. Take it over how clean this interior is to be original. Oil change service stickers. And again, looks like touch up where your foot might scrub as you enter and exit vehicle. Let me do this. Let me pop the hood. It takes two hands. So I'm going to pause. So 
is we did a top and engine service so the heads came off had a sticky valve so you see new tune-up components so you've obviously new valve cover gaskets water pump carburetor rebuild even the air conditioning functions as it should and you can see evidence of that service there a new fitting What a beauty. Battery, obviously. Original radiator. So it's always perplexed me as the, the nomenclature of Buick engines. It says Wildcat 410. It says a two barrel engine. Is this a 364? I'm not really for sure. That sounds terrible. Should probably bone up a little bit. But I will say this, and you can attest this car starts half a turn every time. Clock not functioning. This Art Deco interior. See some touch up paint, other items. Brackets, firing order. Made 37,000 or so of these four door hardtops. The new exhaust also. And when you're recommissioning a car after being parked, you have to touch many of the components, but I tell you, it's all that hard work's been done. A little wear spot here in the carpet. So we'll take her for a ride. AM radio. Power steering, power brakes. Here at our main dealership, where all the cars are serviced. Prepared for sale. About 70 degrees here today in Conway. Beautiful evening. Chrome wheels on this sure is tempting. But they're only 
stock once, we'll let the next guy, maybe that's you, do this. Turn signal, left, right. Good people. 